Hey, how y'all doing? Uh, this afternoon I'm going to put the bass right here on the pond. I had a request to do a review on the rudder. Not a, need to go back and check it out. Pretty simple fix. So, um, I've already used the rudder on a fishing trip. It worked great. I'm going to take it out here on my pond in my front yard and uh, just kind of show y'all how it actually functions on the boat. And uh, the benefits of having the rudder on there, I think you're going to appreciate it. So y'all hang around and we'll get this thing going. Right here we are. Uh, let me apologize for the wind noise. But this is a test to see how that rudder is going to do with windy conditions. What I'm doing, I'm running my trolling motor. It's on about 30% if you can see that. Just kind of holding the boat straight. And then we're going to cut it off. And just see what happens with the wind. We'll try to hold the camera right straight over the top of the trolling motor. And just pick you out a target. And you can see that the boat is starting to turn around in a circle. And you see in this live time. Try not to do anything. I'm gonna straighten it back up. Get the boat straight. I'm gonna head straight towards that utility pole. If you can see that yellow marker on that post. We're going cut the motor off almost instantly to start spinning around okay <clears throat> so I'm gonna put the rudder down now and do about the same test and see what happens okay so here's our rudder we got it mounted on that trolling motor bracket so we're just gonna deploy it got it where it won't turn it's got the shaft locked down right here where the shaft won't turn the rudder will be staying straight let me get back up here in the front now and uh, to the trolling motor and we'll see how it acts okay I got the trolling motor set on about 30 my target pole out there with the yellow post sign on it if you can see it we'll cut the motor off just let it drift All in all, that ain't bad. Compared to running it without the rudder and running it with the rudder, I'd say the rudder is a game changer. Do that one more time. About 30 percent. Cut the motor off.
I'm gonna spin around here and take bring the rudder back on board. out again turn the motor off and immediately the boat starts spinning I'm trying to hold this camera as still as I can right over the top of the trolling motor and right now we've already done a 90 degree turn we'll go the other way Speed the motor up to about 30. Straight toward that little cypress tree. Holding the camera still. Boat spinning. time on the trolling motor than you are fishing so all in all I would say the rudder on the bass raider is a game changer we're starting to spin back the other way now so we're about where we were when I cut the motor off a while ago so we went to about 90 degree angle and then Spun back around to about straight again. Boat starting to drift back away from the tree a little. Starting to make its turn again, so yeah. So I recommend the rudder. Anybody that wants to use the bass raider in any kind of wind conditions, you can see what a difference it makes. So I hope y'all enjoyed the review video on the rudder system. If you did, I hope you'll hit that subscribe button, notification bell, so you'll know when the next videos come available. And uh, we'll catch y'all in the next one.